Hi guys, it's Rick from Tackle Village. Hope you're well. Just back with another quick video. Today I'm just going to talk about the new fly line that I'm using. Um, a quick review of the Airflow, Airflow Super Dry Elite. Um, I've changed to using this um, for the past season. Found it really good. The line I was using for all my sort of river and stream fishing was um, a Jim Teeny line and I'd overline my rod by um, one. So I was uh, using a five weight rod with a six weight line. I've switched to using keeping the overlining, um, but going to this line, which is a little bit more of a finesse um, line. You can sort of um, the, the taper on it's not that aggressive. It's their go-to. It's a new go-to uh, trout line, and I find presentation-wise, it can allow you to make a lot, a lot more delicate presentations while still having that that real snap that you can get to turn line, um, turn the line over if it's a bit windy, or crucially when you're making a lot of really short casts in, in sort of tight structure. You want um, a line that's going to load that rod pretty quickly. Now this is not as good as the one I was using previously for that real short stuff, but you comp the compromise is that you get far better presentation um, with this line uh, for dry flies. So if you're fishing like you know more and more sort of glassy water or, or streams where the fish are, fit, are fussy, a line like this uh, I found um, allowed me to boost my um, catch rate a lot, quite a lot last year in that kind of condition, fishing small dries to fussy fish in flat water. Um, yeah, so there you go guys, it's the Airflow Super Dry Elite Trout um, is the line I've switched to, um, I, and I'd really, really recommend it as a, as a great fly line for sort of river and stream work. Good stuff, and don't forget if you like the video, subscribe, um, hit like, uh, it just helps us spread the word on our YouTube channel, and uh, thanks for tuning in and watching. Hey guys, I was going to um, stop this clip here actually, but I thought I'd um, just take the chance to show you the kind of fishing environment in which this line is a real asset. So here's me um, with a mate uh, just going for a fish late in late autumn. Uh, you'll see that there's a couple of fish feeding in that um, run there on that flat glassy water up near the um, sticks entering the pool there. You just see the water dimple from time to time. We're just trying to get them. It's there. We're using very small fly. I think this was a small size 18 f fly um imitating the mayflies they were eating um and um yeah this is the kind of scenario where you really really want that line to land really softly um so as not to disturb the fish uh, in this sort of environment where they can sort of uh, a badly placed cast or, or put them down and you'll see after sort of three or three or so um, casts there i've managed to um, get this fish it's not going to break any records but um still very satisfying in terms of uh a fish that you've fooled on a fly.